beautiful peeps of YouTube and welcome. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Kat and you're watching Planning Calm. And here in this channel, I love, love, love to share with you all the many ways I can help you plan your way to calm and plan a calmer life. Now, in this video, I am super excited to share this video with you, y'all. I cannot wait to show you what I've been loving this year. This is going to be my 2023 Planner All-Stars, the best of the best planner products that I've used and loved, tried, tested, and true all year for the year of 2023 that I have loved to share with you. Now, I'm sharing these items with you not so that you can run out and buy them, folks. That's not my intention. My intention is to share it with you so that you can be a more informed consumer and spender of your hard-earned dough. I have three categories for stationery, planners, and planner accessories. So I'm gonna share my top picks with all of those items with you. So I hope you enjoy. I hope it's helpful. If it is, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more planner content to keep you calm, baby. <laughs> Alrighty, so, oh, I also apologize. I'm just getting over the vid and pneumonia. So if I sound nasally or whatever, I apologize. Okay, so first on my list is the Micron um, 01 pens by um, Pigma, and they are in the 0.25 millimeter, and I love these pens, y'all. These are the best pens. They last forever. Um, they're a great buy. If you buy them, you know, in a multi-pack, you save a lot of money, and it's just a great, great pen. I use this in my Hobonichis. I use this it pretty much in all of my planners and I absolutely love it. Um, I have a very wide writing loop and I find with this fine tip in my Hobonichis, um, it still allows me to write big, but still keep my writing contained on the page. Love that. My next favorite pen is the Sharpie pen. And this pen is fine tipped as well. And I absolutely love this pen. I use this pen, um, these pens, in my planners as well, and I love them. I get a lot of compliments on my writing when I use this pen. Uh, definitely affordable, easy, accessible. Get them at Staples, Walmart, um, Amazon, all the good stuff. Next up are these dot markers. I used and loved these dot markers all year long, and I absolutely love them. These are the, I'm not even gonna try to say that name, y'all, but you can see it there. Um, and they are the dual tip dot pens. And one side is um, the dot tip, and the other side is a fine tip. And they just work so well in my Hobonichis, uh, in my weeks, in all the planners that I have. They are just such a great, great writing tool. Um, speaking of my favorite writing tools, surprise, surprise, actually really there's no surprise here. There are the Tombos. I love Tombos. They're so good. I, I mean, I know some people will prefer other pens, but I love Tombos. I use them in my planners. I use them at school for work. I use them for grad school. I just, I love them. And at first I was like, good grief, I got so many of them. But I honestly use a lot of these markers. Um, now in terms of um, some accessories I've been really enjoying, I got these um, accessory pouches off Amazon. And they are just great. They came in a pack of 10, five white, five black. And I just keep and house a lot of my on the go planner stuff in here. Um, I just grabbed these from my planner card, but I have a bunch of them with different things in them. And when I wanna plan on the go, um, either at school or with a friend or at the coffee shop or the park, I just grab a couple of these with my stuff in there, throw them in um, my favorite on the go planning bag, which I'll show you in a second, and I'm good to go. These are great, reasonably affordable, and I got these on Amazon and they're just great. So versatile, you can use them for anything. Um, next up, this pencil case. Now I recently got it not too long ago, I'd say maybe four months ago, but this is my all time favorite pencil case. I got it from a, just like a, like a, a bookstore. I love bookstores. Oh, comment down below if you are a book nerd and just love being in a bookstore, especially one that serves like, that has a coffee vibes and they have stationery. But anyway, I found one of these in my town and, or in my city rather, and I just love it. This is such a great, and it sticks in your purse, it sticks in your, my teacher bag. It's just so versatile and it holds so much stuff. Holds so much stuff, it's just, it's great. I love this pencil case. Um, I spent about 
let's see, $15 on it, but worth every penny. And it's made out of leather, very durable, excellent stuff. Um, I have been loving these washi tapes. Now, to be honest with you, I only use washi tape in my Hobonichi and not every week, but um, when I had more time, AKA when I wasn't teaching, <laughs> um, I used and loved these washi tapes and they are just so good. I got them off Amazon. They're so nice, um, not expensive at all. They stick well, they're unique. Um, there's, there's not like the regular washi tape that you get from Michaels and all the other places. They're just so unique and I love them. Now in terms of planners, I have um, some planners that I've used and loved this year that I wanna share with you. The first one, is the um is the happy planner now this is a jumbo big happy planner that i have been using and loving and i use this as my social media planner and um you know it's it's great using this happy planner as my social media planner has been great and i'm not going to show you all the things because i don't want to bore you make this video longer but um i'll move to one i didn't use yet um which is like look how nice and big this is this would be a great planner as a family planner and yeah you could just map out i what i do is i map out all my ideas for the month and then I have like my video ideas at the back and yeah, I just map it out for the week and it could just be simple, something as simple as jotting something down, um, getting my props in order, whatever the case is, I absolutely love it. And loving my Erin Condren Daily Duel. Now this is the one that starts in January because my other one is at school, but I just love this planner. It is, um, it has the month view, and it has a daily view for everything. And for me, like, sometimes I just need that. Sometimes I don't wanna be looking at a week view and trying to, you know, it just overwhelms me with, you know, anxiety issues and stuff. And so this is a perfect planner because I can just take it one day at a time. There's plenty of room and space. I just love this planner. One of my favorite planners this year. And I highly recommend if you want to test out and get an EC product, definitely keep, put your eye on this one. I really, really love it. There's no surprise, absolutely no surprise, that this bad boy here, my Hobonichi cousin, would be on my top list, um, all time list, because I have loved this planner. This has been my planner, my favorite planner all year. This is the one that I've used most consistently and, um, yeah, it's been great. It's been great. Now I use it as a health, mental health and physical health tracker at one point. Um, I use a monthly view to track things and it's just great. It is just great. The weeklies, um, the weekly sheets, so good. I've used it to track everything and um, yeah, it's just been so much fun, so much fun to use this planner. And, you know, some weeks I'll dip in there, some weeks not so much. Um, this is a spread I've used. Um, and I've I've really, really been loving this planner. Um, another planner accessory I've been loving is also my um, planner pouch. Now, th this, I haven't cleaned this out. <laughs> Sorry guys, but I love this planner tote. Uh, this is my favorite planner tote. I got it off Etsy, but you can also get it on um, Amazon as well. And it's just so, so great. I absolutely love it. And um, I love it so much that I'm actually going to be giving one of these away. I bought an extra one and I'm going to be giving it away. It's actually pink. It's still wrapped up in the wrapper here because um, when I got it, I got two. Um, and this is going to go to a lucky uh, subscriber um, as part of my 1,000 uh, subscriber giveaway and appreciation. And so if you want to know how to enter the giveaway, the information will be in the description down below. But I am going to be including some planner goodies, some planner accessories, some of my favorite planner stuff in this giveaway. So one lucky winner will win the bag and all the planner goodies to go inside the bag. So if you want to have an opportunity to win this, just look at the information below so that you know how to get it done. So 
I believe that is it, folks. Um, my stationery, my planners, my planner accessories, all the good things, the best of the best that I've been enjoying this year that I am so happy to share with you. Uh, thank you so, so much for watching. If you like it, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, y'all. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more uh, calm planning and calm living uh, content to come. And until the next video, take care, be well, be blessed, and I'll see y'all in the next planner video. Bye bye, planner peeps. Baby, you give me ice and fire. You're giving me wings.